How's it going everyone? Thanks so much for checking out this toy photography video. This is going to be a quick but really fun one. So I recently got the new Polka Dot Man figure by McFarlane and I really wanted to take a really cool shot with Polka Dot Man because he's just awesome. I'm a superhero! And I did open him up on my live stream last week which was a ton of fun. But as I'm watching this movie and as I'm opening up this figure I'm like, how could I take a really cool toy photo with Polka Dot Man? I have to take a cool photo with him. So eventually it just comes to me and I'm like, oh yeah, duh, those little Orby things, yeah. So I go onto Amazon and I find some of those Orbeez, they're like 10 bucks for a big thing of them, and I buy them. So I get them in the mail real quick, thanks Amazon Prime. I'm like, okay, cool, what are the directions? How do I do this? And there are literally no directions, there's nothing on the back, it just says, just add water. That's literally it. <laughs> so I dumped a few of them in a cup of water, and about half a day or so, they pretty much grew to the full size, which was pretty cool. And these things are literally perfect for polka dot man's polka dots. So I really just want to take a cool photo of him, like in an epic pose where he's like shooting the polka dots out of his arm, or whatever he does, <laughs> and there's just little Little Orbeez bouncing all over the place in the foreground and the background and everything. It's a bright sunny day which is gonna be cool so all the light will shine through the Orbeez and look awesome. So I think I'm just gonna set up and take the photo. Alright, so uh, I got him in the right pose that I want. Ultimately, I decided I wanted to have him just flat on the ground. At first, I liked having him jumping, but I like flat on the ground a little bit more. It'll give a little more opportunity to see more Orbeez jumping up and bouncing and stuff. I think that'll look really cool. So, I'm just going to dump a little water on the floor on the ground to give it a little bit of a reflective surface. And then basically, what I'm going to do is just take some Orbeez and drop them over him and take pictures while they're bouncing and take a ton of them and I'm eventually going to edit them all together to make a really awesome photo. So, yeah, let's go for it. So overall, I think this was a really fun experiment. Uh, <laughs> I think Orbeez are just cool and fun, fun to play with no matter what. So I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with how the shot came out. I think that was really cool. And if you're interested in how I edited it together, uh, I do have a whole live stream about how I layer and edit everything all together still saved on the channel right now. I'll have it tagged right in here. Uh, and also, I would still make sure to try and clean up as many of the Orbeez as possible if you tried. I did read that these are biodegradable and they're not terrible for the environment, but still I would try to clean up as many as possible just to be safe. So if you have any other cool ideas that just kind of popped in your head with using Orbeez and stuff like that, just comment below. I would really love to know because I still have a ton left over and I don't know what to do with them all. <laughs> Plus the picture will be posted on Instagram as well at SirDork730, where all my other photos are posted. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, I'll see you in the next one.